Okay, so I'm going to be giving you an evaluation of living skills. The reason I'm giving you this evaluation is to help determine your specific strengths. It will take approximately 30 to 45 minutes, and I'll be taking notes as the evaluation progresses. If you have any questions, feel free to stop me at any time. Okay. At the end of the evaluation, I'll go over the results with you. Are you ready to begin? All right. Okay. Whatever I can do. If I'm in a bad day, but anyway, I'll do my best. All right. So, first, do this, okay? Yeah. Fill in the form below. Time of the day. Time of the day, but time is it now? Quarter to twelve. Yep. So, how you mark it? Hey, Elena, these things here, I got it confused. That's okay. It's just for school. Yeah. Okay, you can skip that. What yeah. day is it today? Do you know? Today is the uh, quarter to twelve, is it? Yeah, quarter to twelve. Yeah, but what day is it? Oh, <laughs> the, the day. The day is uh, is it Friday today or Tuesday? Friday, yeah. Friday. Okay. Yeah, we're just there, so. Yeah, we were just for breakfast. Hey, you know, I can I can write this thing, Selena. You can write your what's that? Name, my yeah. name. Okay. And what else? Address? And what's minister? I write that. <laughs> Caramia. We are, we are bad here with these okay. things. Okay. I'm sorry. Do okay. your best. You write it. I don't, I don't need to write it. If you can, it's okay. So then, what's this one? H. H, my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> Almost 84 here. Yeah, perfect. Okay. So then... When you come to riding, forget it, sweetie. I know, that's okay, don't worry. Uh, what is this one? Shower? How often do you do the oh, following activities? One. You are due to the following activities. Yeah. What activities I'm going to write? Well, it says shower or bathe, so how often? Shower or bait. I mean, three times a week. I know. Good. Three. Uh, right after yourself. Yeah. Good. Okay. Wash. Clean or wash face. Oh, that Jesus. Every day. Good. Once a day or? Yeah, one is good. Yeah. Okay. Wash your ears. Two times a week. If you're not, you're losing them all. <laughs> Come out, brush the hair, so that one, at least once a day anyway. Mm. Brush the teeth, that's two, once a day. Good. All right. See, this is easy. Yeah. <laughs> oh, my God, difficult things, then forget it. All right. If I made it up to 84 years, I'm still okay. You're okay. All right. So, um... The next thing is I'm going to show you four pictures. There may be a dangerous situation in them or there may not be anything dangerous at all. So look carefully at each of them and each picture you must decide if there's anything dangerous, okay? So I'm going to find the pictures okay. for you. Okay. Well, to me this is danger. Yeah. So what what about it is dangerous? It's danger with electricity if you're Feet wet, then you're in trouble. Yeah. <laughs> and what do you think about that? Yeah, that's what I said. This machine here, mm -hmm. if you dry your ears, if you're not, there's uh, something wrong with it. Yeah. So. Um, so what's dangerous about all of that? The humidity. So because the wet and the, the yeah. wires? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And then the next one. Uh, 
the mama with the girl there. Yeah. So, so do you see anything dangerous in that picture? Well, the medication I see is danger for the little girl. Yeah. Is it? Yeah. So what's dangerous about that? What could happen? Danger can happen a lot of things for the girl. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Because if she can swallow, she can... Yeah. That'd be bad, right? Yeah. Okay. And what about this one? And this one too. Well, this is the flowers that can cause accidents. Okay. And this see one. Anything else? That's the wires in here. Yeah. Yeah. But the machine, it looks like a machine at a table. What is it? Yeah, it's just a table. Just a table. But what about the, the well, cords? What between the flowers, if it's the humidity touching the, the electrical, that's what I thought. So, like if you were watering the plant? Yeah. 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 Do you see anything else dangerous in the picture? Uh, not really, because over here it's... Can you see it okay? Yeah, I can of, see, yeah. yeah. Okay. But over here you don't see much to... No. What is it, uh, like at the, a machine it's there? Like something? Those are just books. Yeah. yeah. But what I see, this is danger. Okay. Alright. Because the humidity, you know, the, the water. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. Okay. And then, and then this is the last picture. Okay. So, do you see anything dangerous in that picture? This is the washing machine, it looks like. Is it? No, no, no it's, it's the oven. The stove, yeah? The oven. What I see that one. Because there's the mouth. No, she's with the coffee. Yeah, she's here. The the she and the, yeah, she's with the coffee. Yeah. And then she's got the water here. Right. What could be dangerous about that? Hmm, that's tricky. It's a tricky one. What is she doing? I'm afraid for the water. Yeah. To have it there when she's working on top of it. Toby. When she's reaching over top, right? Yeah. Good. All right. Yeah. All right. You passed. I passed? Yeah. My God. Poor <laughs> dummy woman. No. <laughs> All right. You're not done yet, though. Uh, I don't show myself that I know what I don't. <laughs> All right. Hey, listen, one. if I come up to you, I don't think you're going to have anything bad to say about Nola, right? No, nothing <laughs> bad to say about you. Okay. I took care of you when you was little. One. <laughs> I know. Okay. And you trust me then, so you better trust me now, too. <laughs> yes. Okay. All right. I got to ask you some more questions, though, okay? Okay. All right. But we better put it in love, huh? <laughs> Alright, oh, so what would you do for yourself if you got sick with a cold? I do for myself, I make a brulee. <laughs> Warm it up your stomach. Okay. Um, would you do anything else? You warm else? it up your, your stomach, that helps you out. Mm -hmm. eh? yeah. So whatever lemonade, whatever you feel like to okay. do it. I um, say brulee because this is the top one when you're cold. Yeah. At least Italian remedy. Okay. Um, okay, so would you do anything else? For what? If you were sick with a cold. Well, if I'm sick with a cold, you have to keep yourself warm and stay away from the, the, the drafts, you know, something like that. Yeah, okay. Uh, you um, can have something to warm it up your chest if you wanted to, yeah, but good. that's always you have to go with something warm. Eh? Yeah. All right. What would you do if you burned yourself and the wound became infected? Oh well, then that is problem. Then you have to go to the doctor and have a check. Yeah. Because this can be danger. Okay. Um. So. Would do you know? Um. How would you get to the doctor? Well, if you can go, you have to call. Mm -hmm. And how would you call? Call the, the pharmacy, the doctor, mm -hmm. whatever, somebody to help you. Yeah. Because if you don't have the doctor, you can have the pharmacy that will help you out. Mm -hmm. Because that's what we did for myself this past week. There was no doctor, we went to the clinic. You went to the clinic, yeah. Yeah, okay. and that's what it took care of you, eh? Mm -hmm. To yeah. my thinking. Yeah. 
Um, so. Look what a beautiful face I end up being later in. <laughs> I don't feel good. You're fine. <laughs> All right, what would you do if you suddenly started having severe chest pains and shortness of breath? That's what I have it later here, that I'm still not clear. Well, that's because you had bronchitis. But, like, I mean, severe, like, chest pains. Yeah. Well, I don't have that or chest pains, no. No, but what would you do if you did? If I do like that, what do you want to do? I never have anything I've done like that, so... Okay, but if something like that happened, what would you do? Hmm. You try your best. <laughs> what can you do? Yeah, but what, where do you think you need to go? Like you what, need to go what, to the how doctor. How you get help? Yeah. To go to the doctor, the first thing. If you not, if you don't find the doctor, you go to the clinic. Yeah, but severe chest pains and shortness of breath. Yeah. Where do you think you need to go for that? Go in the hospital. Yeah, okay. Yeah, so how because would you... it can be heart attack, eh? Right, right. So... Yeah, then that's what you go in the hospital. So what telephone number would you use to call the hospital? Emergency. Yeah, what, what number is it? Uh, I don't know the number. If you had an emergency, who would you call? You go right there in the, in, how in the you hospital. Get there? How would you get there? Well, you have to call somebody to help you. <laughs> who would you call? The neighbor. Okay. <laughs> the closer to, to you. Okay. Because how you want to do it, Finat? Yep. All right. So if your house caught on fire, what telephone number would you call for help? Uh, that is uh, the, the number for it. See, I got all the numbers there in case of something emergency. Yeah. So what number? Do you know the number? Yeah, I might look. Let me see. Good idea, Alina. Oh. I'm not on the numbers here. <laughs> here, I'm going to show the camera what numbers. Okay, so what number point? Okay, what is it? What does it say? At the very top. Yeah. Police, fire, or ambulance? Call the ambulance. Yeah, what number is that? <laughs> the number, the ambulance. It's 911. Right, there you go. See? So you found it. I found it. See? You find everything I love you wanted to. Okay. Even a dummy like me. <laughs> <laughs> You're not a dummy. Okay. Uh, Next no. one. See, I didn't think of that or should know it. <laughs> the emergency, yeah? Yeah, you should probably know that one. But, but okay. what can you do? All right. So if you needed to see a doctor, where would you go? You need to see a doctor. Well, you go to the to the office. If it's not the office, you gotta go to the clinic. Okay. And where where would the clinic or the doctor's office be located? Well, some there on Tecumseh, like I went the other day. It's on Tecumseh. Yeah. Tecumseh Walker Road. Yep. Yeah, the, the doctor clinic. is close to it. Yeah. So. Okay. Uh, and if you needed dental care, where would you go? To the dentist. Yeah. If it's Where? not the dentist, you've got to go to someplace else just to help you out. Mm-hmm. For um, the kids. Where, where is their dentist located? It's located to, where's the name there? There's like the daughter and the dentist is just around there. The same thing. Mm -hmm. What street is that one? I, don't, I really don't know. But that. you know, do you know how to get there? Where would you drive? You drive to Comsey all the way down. Mm-hmm. The street there, what is it? Where the the school is there that I turn, mm -hmm. and it took me right to the doctor there. Okay. So, so you know how to get there if you had to go there. Yes, if I know to go there, yeah. That's my family doctor. You know that is you know what it is because you go in there too, eh? With mama. Yes. It's the same same place there. Close to it. Okay. So, um, see, it's little things that right here you don't think about it, but if, it's, if you know, if it's something happened, you know where to go. You know how to get help, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So, 
I'm going to give you five dollars and you're gonna buy this toothbrush from me. Oh, okay. okay. The toothbrush costs four dollars and fifty-eight cents including tax. Yeah. Um, you give me the five dollars and I give you the toothbrush so here's the five dollars. Okay, and I give okay. you the toothbrush. So you're buying this toothbrush from me. It's okay. four fifty-eight. Okay. So give me the five dollars. Okay. So you give me the I'm change. I'm gonna give you the change. That's right? cute. <laughs> okay, so is this the right amount of change? Okay, because you got 25, 25, 26, 27. Yeah, so is that the right amount of change? I think so. For $4.58 from $5? Yeah. From $5, yeah. I think. I, I've not figured out yet. <laughs> <laughs> so you, you got five. five, yeah, and it costs four fifty-eight. So yeah. you got the different, you got it right here, five, five, six, eight, where is it? So four fifty eight. Yeah. Can you see the tag right? Mm-hmm. Okay. So this one is what it came the change from the five dollars. Yeah, but is it the right amount? I'm not sure. I have to figure out. Okay. Now. So you said that there was twenty five, thirty five. Yeah. There's thirty five to six to seven. From yeah. four dollars and fifty eight cents. Uh, that one I can't figure out, Elena. Do you think it's right or do you think it's wrong? To me, I think it's right. You think it's right? Yeah. Okay. Is it or no? It doesn't matter. Let's just pretend anyways. Okay. So, now you're going to buy this deck of cards from me. Yeah. Okay? So, the deck of cards um, costs... 3838. Three, yeah, 338. In, including tax, and this is the money that you have to purchase the deck. So you get. Figures they are out of my mind now, Lena. Okay, so you have this much money to buy this from me. Is that enough? Okay, that's uh, one dollar, three dollars, mm -hmm. three. 25, 30, you got 37, I'm missing one. Uh, oh, yeah, where did that dime go? No, oh, no, it's there. Is it? Okay, count again. Yeah, because look, the $3 mm -hmm. and then it's 30, 38 cents, so this is 25. 25, 30, 30, 30 38, no, 30, 40, no, yeah. it's over. Yep, 40, over. No, so this is how much money you have, okay? Yeah. So you need to buy this from me. Do you have enough money for it? Yes. Okay. Yeah, because you got the three, and then the rest of it, you got extra. Yep, so you have three dollars, and how many cents? Yeah, six, you got 60 years. 70, 78, so. Count again. So $3. Yeah. What's this? Oh, maybe this, we didn't count five, five cents, we counted before, eh? Yeah. Yeah, so this is 25 instead. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 25, 30, yeah. mixed 30, then 8 cents, 30. 40. 40, 42, so there we're missing. Go. So. So this is three dollars and thirty-eight cents. So yeah. you said, do you have extra money or just the right amount? No, you got the extra money. Yeah. How much extra do you have? Oh, you have to figure out again. Yeah. So what did we say? Three dollars and three, 40, three, forty, fifty. No, forty-two, right? Yeah. Yeah. So you counted that. So how much extra do you have for three dollars and thirty-eight cents? So I said, we have to figure out again. Okay. Oh, Jesus. <coughs> Gotta go again. 30, 40. Mm -hmm. This 40 says we're over again. Yeah, so how much over are you? Yeah. Uh, 40, I'm over 20 cents. Not 20. So this is 40, right? Yeah, this is 40, 25, 25, 30, 
40. 42. Mm -hmm. 42. And we got 38, so yeah. we got extra. Mm -hmm. So you're extra 40, 48, 32, 48, that's 5 cents extra. Good. Alright. See, it takes a while to figure out. Okay. My head is not there. Really. You're used to just using cash, right? Not yeah. change. Okay. <coughs> so. Um. So this is your utility bill, right? So how do you yeah. pay your bills? We do from the bank or we send a check. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Um, okay. So how much money is due on this bill? Yes, hundred and forty thirty nine. Yep. And when is the bill due? The bill due is uh I have to check up here. <coughs> <coughs> Union gas change uh, tax. Total payment I don't know I told date May twenty nine. That is due to May 29, the sex. May or what month? The month now is um, I think I get confused with this thing. Okay. So you said May, but instead of May, what does it say? May, June. No. no. Mm. May, uh, April. What does it say there? 60. Oh, date is March. Yeah, there 29. You, go. There you Yeah, go. you got it now. Okay, so you're just confusing the R for a Y. Yes. Yeah. And my head is not right, oh, Elena. Okay. That's confusing. All right. <coughs> so, my God, this thing. how do you normally pay the bill? No, the, to pay the bill. It's withdrawn from the bank, right? Yeah, withdraw from the bank. So, what is your source of income? My source of income? Just the retired people. Retired uh, income. Yeah. Do you have any other source of income? No. Okay. This is the pension, man. Yeah. So. Um, so, if you don't receive the money one month, what would you do to find out what happened? If I don't receive the money from in a month, uh -huh. I have to go to the authorities. The authorities? Okay, so how yeah. would you do that? Well, you have to go to the closest one you know. Okay. Who would, so would you call or would you, where would you go? Well, first I call and then they're going to send me where to go. That's the only way to find out. So, uh, how do you get from one place to another in Windsor? Well, there's a lot of places to go. You can go to Tecumseh and you can go to Windsor. So those are streets, right? Yeah. Okay. Um, but, but what kind of transportation would you use? I use the car. If I don't have the car, it's the bus. Do you know how to use the bus? Well, I have to go to the bus station and take it. <laughs> okay. If not, where do you want to go? Right, when's the last time you used the bus? Oh, quite a few years ago. Use the taxi in case. Okay, what was, when was the last time you used the taxi? Another thing. I never use it. <laughs> <laughs> so when was the last time you drove somewhere then with your car? Because you said you use your car, right? Yes, I use my car. I can go to the daughter. I go to the grocery. I go visit friends. Yeah. I go to a party. I went to a party the other day by myself. So there you with go. A car. <laughs> there you go. All right. So, so you didn't need to use the bus for that, right? You no, normally use I the never car. use the bus. Yeah. No. Okay. Let's get to the car. Yeah. 
Okay. So, um, is there public transportation like buses or subways available where you live? Yes. We got the bus right there, right? So if you needed to take a bus, how would you know what time and which location to use? I'm going to the Comsey. That's the stop. That's the closest stop. Yeah. Okay. Um, That's what we used to use it to when the kids was going to school, always the bus. Eh? Yeah. All right. So, we're going to call. You was coming with me too, every place I was going. Even with the bus, we got again. You don't remember those things? No, I don't remember that. <laughs> Where am I going to leave it? No, no, we have one car, eh? No, no, we have it to the job. Yeah. And we will take the bus. You even come at the, at the hotel with the bus, you and Olivia. Okay. Olivia. Um, okay, so I'm going to make you call the movie theater. Yeah, the movie theater is a long time I don't go there. I know. Okay. Um, so, I'm going to have you call as soon as the number comes up. I should have had it ready. Um, and you're just going to tell me that the, the first movie and what time today it's going to be shown. So when you call the movie theater, it's going to tell you... I will say maybe 5 o'clock. I'm going to have you call, so you just got to tell me what the phone tells oh. you. Just, it's not giving what me a number. Call? I just got to find the phone number. Your internet's being slow. Okay, it's because I'm not connecting. Can I the Are you guys on the internet? I need it and it's not working. Okay. Are you? We tried to connect. And something's not working? Okay, I'm gonna look at the newspaper for the phone number. Huh. This phone number ready. I thought I could just look it up on my phone. But... And what do you need all these things for, Elena? That's just part of this. No, test. just part of it at the test, I yeah. think. And everything like myself, I understand after the day. <laughs> oh boy. Okay, so I found the number. All right. So. Um, oh, you found the number? Yeah, I found it. So, actually, I have to let you dial it. Okay, so the number is 519. 519. Yeah. Um, 0197. Okay, and press call. Good. Okay. And I'm going to, oh, no, I'm this just going to put it on speaker. Oh, okay. Hello, and thank you for calling Odeon Devonshire Mall Cinemas wow. for Showtime. Press 1. For theater one. location, and then you're press just going to tell me or the visit first movie Cineplex. times. Com, where you can find details on our events, party programs, and admission pricing. For Friday the 17th, March, Friday press 17th. 1. For Saturday oh. the 8th, press 1 to go back, 2 to repeat, 3 to skip forward, or 4 for a short movie description. Oh. Kong Skull Island 3D. With closed captioning, Kong oh, Skull sucks. Island. Just wait for With the closed time. captioning and descriptive services. Rated 14A. Runtime 1 hour and 50.
59 minutes. Show times 4.30 p.m. Okay, so what's the... The shack. 4.30. Closed captioning and description. Okay, so that's the first movie being shown at, at yeah. one time. 4.30, right? 4.30, yeah. Okay, that's a silly question. All right. Well, what can you do? If it needs it. Yeah, okay. So... Um... This, you don't have to do this. Okay, so what do you do in your leisure or free time? Leisure, free time. Watching TV. <laughs> <laughs> do you do anything else? Cooking, baking. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Do you do any of those activities with other people? Not anymore. <laughs> um, so when was the last time you watched TV? Yesterday. Today I don't watch TV yet. Not yet? No. Uh, when's the last time you cooked? I cook this morning. I make my breakfast. What did you have? What I have at... I don't even know now. Coffee. I make coffee yeah. and a toast. Uh, and when's the last time you baked? That one is about quite a while that I don't bake because nobody's eating anymore. <laughs> I don't have anybody here. I would say maybe a month ago. Yeah, you made, you made cookies, right? Yeah. yeah. All right. So. See, because the cook is there, they're getting old, they, because the kids, they don't come anymore. Yeah. Special no, I was doing a good cleanup, but I never <laughs> see him anymore. Yeah, no one's busy. All right. So, so you're all done. I'm done? You're all done. Poor stupid me, huh? No! All right, just wave to the camera. Hey, bye. I'm done? Yeah. You can say bye to the camera. Bye-bye. <laughs> I'm done.